Ah. Hello everyone and welcome to the Writer's Loft here at the Teepee Wind Ranch. I am so excited. It is uh, the middle of May and that means it's time to travel to the Green River, Fleming Gorge. We're going to float the Fleming Gorge on a fly fishing extravaganza. Um, I'm leaving uh, tomorrow morning at sunrise. We're going to pack up the van uh camp out we're gonna do uh hopefully two days of bank fishing and then i'm gonna float on one day get together with my guide it's gonna be it's gonna be a great trip um, we're gonna catch a lot of fish and we're gonna have some fun and uh endure uh which is what we do best so uh before we do that i want to take you out introduce you to my fly fishing slash camping slash hunting vehicle we're going to do that real soon so uh stay tuned to this channel man we're gonna have a good time and i'm gonna bring it all to you well okay so i'd like to introduce you to my hunting vehicle. This is a uh, 2011 Ford E350 van. The E350 means it has one ton axles. I bought this thing and I had it drop shipped in uh, Quigley Motors in Pennsylvania. And they put the front end on here. It's, they put in a uh, uh, F350 one ton axle and did a four inch lift kit conversion. This baby's all tricked out, ready for the road, ready for camping, ready for fly fishing. We're going to take a look at some of the features here, just from the exterior, uh, 17 inch wheels, four wheel drive obviously, kicks ass. Um, that safari rack is from Illuminus. Uh, that's a big one up on top. We'll get a more intimate look at that in a little bit here. I just want to take you around the outside of the van. Yeah, baby. Aftermarket Luminous bumpers. That's what we're looking at here. I have a uh, cargo rack or a, uh, a luggage rack. It fits on the back of here, on that trailer hitch right there. And uh, we'll get that rocking later. We're going to load her up. We're going to the green, man. We're going to go float the green. It's that time of year. Come on over here. Let's open this up. Get a more intimate look. Ta-da! So the van has uh, 145 amp... Um, alternator in it which charges two gel filled batteries uh, six volt batteries that are lined in series the van has has AC power DC power uh, there's my bed walnut cabinets uh, auxiliary speaker jacks it's got an amp in it for tunes uh, microwave DC refrigerator plenty of counter space and then that's a Tempur-Pedic mattress bed right there as well Closets, storage, all walnut cabinets. This is all custom work. Let's see if we can get in or get in the back here. See how that swings open there. And get a look at the back. All right, there she is. I got a couple of crate mattresses on there as well. This drawer right here, this drawer right here opens out. It's on 500 pound rails. That opens up and uh, is all for cargo and you can see the walnut trim around here 
or on the outside. Yeah, baby. Yeah, we're gonna get this thing loaded up and we're gonna head to the green tomorrow morning at sunrise. We're gonna get her done. There's the ever lovely Robin on her way, Hi. on her way to her Hi, multi Daddy. multiple appointments. It's girl day today. She's gonna miss the green this year, unfortunately. She's my photographer and she's abandoning me. So it's a it's a boys trip. <laughs>
and here's the guy professionally handling the fish. <laughs> <laughs> And the fish is cooperating. Oh. Yeah, I resuscitate them. Right? We're resuscitating the fish. CPR was performed in the usual fashion. I'm doing it now. <laughs> fish CPR. Got a big rainbow here. Nice. Nice big bow. Dumped the boat on this one, have you?